From a distance, you might think it was a theme park. The wooden framework of a brand new Pompidou centre here in Metz, northeast France, is just as distinctive as its namesake in the capital. And like the original, this is designed to be a lively community centre filled with cafes and bookshops, as well as a museum. Well, first of all, this is gathering space. Then second, it's a museum. So I try to create the space for the people to, 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 to just gather like a cafe. Then the, the people come into the museum. It's the first time a major Paris museum has opened a separate branch in the regions, and the Louvre plans to follow suit in a few years' time. Nearly all the works on show here have been loaned from the Pompidou Centre in Paris, the bulk of whose holdings are normally kept in storage. Instead of a permanent collection, the museum will rotate its exhibitions up to half a dozen times a year. And their current show is one of the year's biggest in France. 700 works, including masterpieces from Picasso, Kandinsky and Matisse. For the local public, the, the key to success will be the appropriation of this project by the population here. We want to root this institution into a territory. We want to serve a different community. We want to introduce this community to modern and contemporary art. This is a region that's traditionally been known more for its factories and military garrisons than its cultural gems. But if this generates further investment, Many art fans are now hoping the Pompidou could do for Metz what the Guggenheim did for Bilbao.